confidants. How y'all doing? Welcome in. We're not going to be in here long, but I just looked at this news and I have some questions because what is going on with these celebrities? I know they say like genius is close to insanity, but I'm starting to think celebrity is close to insanity because because what is really like, what are we doing? <laughs> what are we doing? These people have so much money, they don't know what to do with the money or themselves. So apparently Floyd Mayweather is trapped in Dubai and he cannot leave for financial reasons. So according to what I looked up, and I'm just going to say allegedly in advance because there's so many stories going around as to what he's actually trapped in Dubai for. But according to what I saw, it said apparently Mayweather was fronted a substantial amount of cash at a private casino in or near Dubai. He promptly lost all the money and now he can't leave Dubai until he's paid back what he owes. According to the boxing promoter Rick Glaser, Mayweather is being detained by the UAE government court system. Glazer said this on his Twitter on Monday. Just got off the phone with my guy in Dubai. He told me that hashtag Floyd, hashtag Mayweather is definitely being held by the government court system there as he owes a substantial amount of money in Dubai. They take indebtedness over there very seriously. Was told the debt is hashtag unassociated with hashtag boxing. Floyd's desperately trying to work things out to no avail so far. So at Gervonta, hashtag Tank Davis, is correct that Floyd's being held there. Boxer Gervonta Tank Davis first broke the news that Mayweather was being held captive in Dubai. On Tuesday, Davis continued to mock his former boss on social media. He tried to leave today. They said, nope, sit still before I F you up. The news media has been suspiciously quiet about Mayweather's predicament. The White House is also noticeably quiet about the boxing champ's dire straits. Floyd Mayweather is just as well known for his lavish millionaire lifestyle as he is for his incredible 50 and 0 fighting record. So it also says the U.S. boxer, whose fortune is estimated at $700 million, loves to show off his worldly possessions on his social media accounts with dozens of photos of his luxury car collection, expensive watches, and stacks of cash. So, y'all, I'm so confused. Number one, this is why I say what is going on with these celebrities, because I've heard that Floyd has anywhere between 400 million and 700 million is his estimated worth. Still, with that kind of money, what, 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 what are we doing? What are we doing and how, how are you trapped in Dubai on financial issues is what I don't understand. I've heard that he was supposed to pay some people that he didn't pay. Not this casino thing, that it was something else. This is why I say at the end of my videos, if it doesn't cause you to elevate, it's causing you to depreciate. Because how much money were you fronted at a casino? And what were you doing to lose it all? Because it says that he lost it all promptly. So this is what has me so confused about celebrityism. And this is why I say to you all that before you start thinking about rising to the top, make sure that you are mentally and emotionally prepared to handle it. Because a lot of these celebrities weren't mentally and emotionally prepared. They had a gift that thrust them to the top, but they didn't know what to do when they got there. Because what? Someone with a record like Floyd Mayweather shouldn't constantly be caught in stupidity. And you, but worse than that, help me understand how there's no news coverage of this, how there's no breaking news reports to this. There's nothing. So is this all a lie? Like what is really going on? Like I'm so confused. And to top it off, when I was looking this up, I also saw that he's in the process of being sued. Yeah, he's being sued because someone who was driving his vehicle had a crash in his vehicle and the lady who the individual hit is now suing him. So it says, 
He's in a lawsuit in Nevada over a car accident with injuries. According to documents obtained by the blast, the victim in the car is suing Mayweather and the driver of the car he owned. Mayweather wasn't in the car when it was in the accident, and of course he can't respond to the lawsuit because he's being held in Dubai, allegedly. Catherine Adelia Burke claims she was T-boned by a car owned by Mayweather on September 13, 2022. The car was driven by his employee, and the name is either Desja or Deja Berry. Driving through the inter intersection without stopping, she collided with the right side of Catherine's vehicle in a T-bone fashion. The documents state that Berry failed to stop at the intersection marked with a stop sign, failed to drive cautiously, failed to yield to Catherine, who lawfully had the right-of-way, and by failed to exercise reasonable care while driving. The document also stated that Deja Berry was incompetent, inexperienced, or the operation of the vehicle provided to her by Mayweather Promotions. Burke is seeking general and specific damages, past and future in excess of 15000 for her injuries. So he's trapped in Dubai with a lawsuit in the state, and nobody's reporting on this at all. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, but I'm starting to be over celebrities. I, I really am, because it's just, it's too much. It's, it's too much and not enough. It's, it's like the celebrities are becoming viral for the shit that has nothing to do with what they're celebrity for. Boxers not being talked about in the news for boxing. Actors not being talked about in the news for acting. It's what are we doing as a world? Like, <laughs> you know, I used to want to be a celebrity. I did. I used to want to be famous. When I was a kid, I wanted to be on Nickelodeon, the Disney Network. But now looking at what's going on with all these celebrities now, number one my whole childhood is ruined let's just say that now because people that i looked up to i found out they trash i'm fine right here on youtube with my confidence is all i'm saying <laughs> i can encourage y'all because this foolishness right here and if it was an isolated incident of foolishness then i could just say you know what it's just floyd mayweather but it's not isolated there was an old saying that i heard years ago and that old saying was, power corrupts, but absolute power absolutely corrupts. And we can see it in the everyday life with these celebrities. The way that you tell the character of an individual is to give them a little bit of power. Because power will show who you really are on the inside. Because how do you have the amount of money that Floyd Mayweather has? And you're trapped in Dubai because... You blew an undisclosed amount of money that apparently somehow you can't pay back, but supposedly, allegedly, you have 400 to 700 million. Make it make sense. Because, yeah, I'm over it. And if this is true, why is no one reporting on it except the blogs and random news reports? Well, news articles. I mean, why, why is no one reporting on this? No breaking news. No message from the president about a U.S. citizen being detained in Dubai and everything that they're doing to try to work it out with Dubai so he can be released. They are saying nothing. So what is this? Is this a publicity stunt? Is this to get out of lawsuits? Like, what are we doing here? Y'all, I, I can't. Drop in the comments and let me know what you think about this video. Confidants, always remember, if it doesn't cause you to elevate, just like this, it's causing you to depreciate. So raise those glasses, clink, and let's drink till we meet again. Ta-ta.